So according to the question, the fourth, seventh, and last terms of a GP are 10, comma 80 and 2560. And we have been asked to find the first term and number of terms in the GP. So I let kar lete number of terms in the GP are <coughs> n. So a4 is equal to 10, a7 is equal to 80, and a n is equal to 2560. So we know that the general term of GP is a n is equal to a times r to the power n minus 1. So for n is equal to 4, a4 is equal to a times <coughs> r to the power 3 is equal to 10 and a7 is equal to 8 times r to the power 6 is equal to 80. Now we get equations 1 and 2. Dividing 1 from 2 we get <coughs> a times r to the power 6 divided by 8 times r to the power 3 is equal to 80 divided by 10. Now this implies r to the power 3 is equal to 8. So our common ratio which is equal to r is 2. <coughs> now in equation 1 a r q is equal to 10. So we get 2 times we get a times 2 q is equal to 10 this implies a is equal to 10 by 8 is equal to 5 by 4 so now we know the first term which is equal to 5 by 4 and the common ratio r which is equal to 2 and now putting in the equation 3 which was a r to the power n minus 1 is equal to 2560 which implied the last term now this implies 5 by 4 times 2 to the power n minus 1 is equal to 2560. This implies 2 to the power n minus 1 is equal to 2560 into 4 by 5 which is equal to 512 is equal to 2048. This implies 2 to the power n minus 1 is equal to 2 to the power 11 which is equal to 2048. This implies we get n minus 1 is equal to 11 on comparing the coefficients, the exponents. This implies n is equal to 12 which is our final answer. So, in the next video, we will see सम ऑफ टर्म्स ऑफ एन जी पी कैसे फाइंड करते हैं